Hi guys, welcome to this session. In today's session, we're going to see how to set up conversion tracking in case of when we do pixel conversion, uh, we want to set it up with pixels. So once you log into your Google, into your LinkedIn ads account, the first thing which we're going to start off with is looking at how to install the inside tag. Once the tag has been implemented, then we'll create a new conversion for using pixel conversion. So let's begin with that. So for Setting up inside tag, we can go to analyze guys on the left panel. And here we can go to inside tag. Now, LinkedIn provides you with three options to set up this code. One is we can install the tag ourselves. We can take the code from here and paste it on our website at the back end. The second is we can send it to a web developer who can do the same job for us. Or else we can also make use of a tag manager to, to do the same action. So let's begin with the first option. Let's say we want to set up the code ourselves. So we can go to the first option and we can copy the code from here. Now LinkedIn gives us an instruction that it has to be put in the website's global footer. That would be the easiest way out. Okay, so we copy this and now we can go to our website. I have built my website on Wix. So this is the website guys. Now we can also check first whether this website has any tags already or not for which there is a Chrome extension called the LinkedIn Insight Tag Checker, which you can install. This extension will check whether there is any code implemented already or not. So when you click on it and you inspect, you can see it clearly says that the LinkedIn Insight Tags were not found, which means this website does not have any code currently. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off with it, wherein we'll go to the dashboard of the Wix account. Now here, the code which we have copied, we will paste it at the back end. So for doing that, we can go to the left panel in settings. In settings, guys, we are specifically going to come to advanced settings in custom code. Here, you will be able to paste the code. Now, since we have to put it in the website footer, we can go to the board end of the body. And here, we can paste it. So now you can see the LinkedIn conversion tracking code, the inside tag is pasted over here and which we can apply. Once you apply this, you can refresh the website so that it takes the code into consideration. And simultaneously now, we can go to our website to test the code as well, whether it is firing properly or not. Okay, so from here, now if you go to the extension and we do an inspect, you can see it says that the status is success. They also show the partner ID, which has been implemented. So now this website has the inside tag implemented. Now what we are gonna do is we are going to go back to our account and we are going to create that conversion tracking, which is a pixel conversion tracking, okay? So we're going to create a new conversion and we can start giving information. Let's say this is for specifically for purchase. We can choose uh, the appropriate action over here. And let's say we have LinkedIn is also asking us to provide a value of this a conversion, which means how much revenue are we going to generate by this particular purchase, which happens. So we can give the amount over here. And we select the time frame as well for which the conversion will be counted for. So we can give the time frame for clicks and views out here. And finally, on this page, we can set up the attribution model also for this conversion. Attribution models will basically help us to know how to go ahead and attribute the ad interactions, credit them for the conversions they bring in. Okay, so which you can set over here. So LinkedIn provides you with two options, which is each campaign and last campaign. So you can choose each campaign here. And now, it will ask us to link this conversion action, this conversion which we are creating to all campaigns or some of the campaigns in the account. So you have both the options. We can apply it to all the campaigns or we can select particular campaigns to which we want to apply this conversion tracking we are setting up. After you do this, we are coming to the last section where we will have to go ahead and install the code. We have to see where to paste the code. Okay, so again, LinkedIn provides you with the setup wherein first they provide you the inside tag, which we have already copied and pasted. So now we just have to go to the second part. Here we are defining the conversion tracking method. So in this, 
what we wanted to look at today was the pixel conversion. So pixel conversion is basically a setup wherein an image pixel code is given to you, which you can paste on the page. Okay. So what it will basically track is when this particular code gets loaded, that means that the conversion has happened. So this can be implemented at the thank you page. Okay. After a purchase, or you can put it on the submission page after a form has been filled. Okay. So if the page loads and the image shows up that is an indicator that the conversion has happened and it should be tracked in the linkedin ads account so this is the code guys as you can see out here it's a gif okay which will load once the conversion happens okay so we can copy it from here and then paste it on that particular thank you page in this manner we can go ahead and implement pixel conversion as well and now you can create the conversion tracking I hope this makes sense now that this is going to be the process through which we can also set up and we can do, we can track our conversions in LinkedIn ads account with pixel conversions. Thank you so much guys for listening into this session today. Have a great day guys.